Hello guys, welcome to another new video. In this video, I am going to show you how to use custom toolbar in Filmora 11. It's a new update of Filmora 11 version 11.6.6. .6. Now you can edit more faster on Filmora 11. So without any delay, let's get started. So open your updated Filmora, then go here and you can see a custom toolbar option added here. Click on this and you can see a new window appear here. Here's all our tools. Now all tools will be added by default. You can now customize all tools. To remove any tools, just drag the tool in the new window from the toolbar like this. Just drag this and you can see tool has been removed from the toolbar. To add the tool to the toolbar do same thing. But now select tool and drag to the toolbar. So as you can see it's so easy. You can also change the tool's position by dragging like this. After setting the position, click on save for save these settings. You can also reset all tools. Click on reset for reset all. Now you can add or remove your tools according to your choice. One other tools has been added in this update which is timeline snapping tool. So how to use these tools? Let's see. First add two video into the timeline. Split and drag one part right side. Now we have two videos and a blank space in the middle. Now turn off snapping mode. And try to match two part. And here you can see one part is easily overlapping to other part. Now turn on snapping mode and do same thing. And here you can see a green bar appear here. This green bar indicate last part of previous video. This can help you quickly line up edits with other items in the project. So it's all about custom toolbar. I hope you guys understand all things. If you don't understand, please let us know in the comment section below. And if you enjoy this video, please like and subscribe to our channel for more cool tutorial. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.